Peculiar Pets by Victoria Roberts and Deborah Allwright. Mum, can I have a pet? Please. Mum, Mum, can I? Can I have a pet? We'll see. So I see. I see a rock. A smooth rock. I put string around it. I call him Fluffy. I take Fluffy for walks. I let him off his lead if he's good. And he's good for a day or two. Mum, can I have a pet? Please. Oh, Mum. Mum, can I? Can I have a pet? We'll see. So I see. I see a glove, a soft, woolly glove. I put it in a basket. I call her Nibbles. I tickle Nibbles in her basket. I feed her whenever she's hungry. And she's hungry. For a day or two. Mum, can I have a pet? Please. Mum, Mum, can I? Can I have a pet? We'll see. So I see. I see a sweet wrapper. A shiny, sweet wrapper. I put it in a bowl. I call him William. I give William water. I see him twist and turn as he swims. And he swims for a day or two. Mom, can I have a pet? Please. Mom, Mom, can I? Can I have a pet? We'll see. So I see. I see a balloon. A round balloon. I draw a face on it. I call him Bruce. I stroke Bruce. And he sticks to me when we hug. And we hug. And we play. And we dance about, and Bruce is my best pet ever. For a day or two. Bang! Mum! Mum! My pet popped! He was my best pet ever. And now I can't play with him. Oh, that's a pity. Never mind. Perhaps we can find another pet for you to play with. Let's see. So we see. We see a box, a cardboard box. We lift the lid, we peep inside, and we see. T. 
Timmy the kitten. And Timmy is the best pet in the world. The end.